Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to connect your OneDrive to NAN. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Okay, the first thing what we need to do is understand what you're connecting. So NAN is an automation tool that lets you connect different apps and services without writing code. And OneDrive is Microsoft's cloud storage where you can upload, access and manage files. So now connecting OneDrive to NAN allows you to automate actions like uploading files, downloading documents, creating folders, and deleting or managing OneDrive content. Okay, so before we start, you need to make sure you have access to NAN Workspace here, either self-hosted or the cloud version, and a Microsoft account with OneDrive access. Now, from here, go ahead and open up a web browser and then go to your NAN Workspace, and then from here, simply log into your Workspace. Now from here we want to go ahead and click on the create workflow button and then from here we can change our workflow name like for example OneDrive connection. Then from here we're going to have a big plus icon so we're going to, hit, going to go ahead and add the first step. Now in this search node section type in OneDrive and then go ahead and click on OneDrive. This node lets you perform actions inside your OneDrive account. Then from here, we need to go ahead and connect your OneDrive account. So click on the OneDrive node you just added. Then from here where it says credentials to connect with. So go ahead and click on create new credential. And then we need to go ahead and connect my account. Then a little pop-up should appear. That's going to log you into your Microsoft OneDrive. Should automatically do it if you're already signed in. You just got to give accept these terms. So I'm going to accept all of these. And then you should see connection successful. This window will close in five seconds, but just click out of it. And then from here, you will say connection account connected. Then from here, just simply click out of it. And now when we come back here, we can see we are credentials to connect with, which is our Microsoft Drive account. All right, so we can um, change the poll times here from every minute to every hour, day, week month or even custom and trigger on we can uh, file created uploaded folder created folder updated we can also watch folder if we like and simplify this then on the left hand side we got fetch test event then it'll say testing a node overwrites pin data i'm going to go ahead and unpin and test so then you can see a node ex executed successfully 